Welcome to the chapter. Let us do an activity to understand the concept of center of gravity. Click each tab to know more. Take a glass and place it on the table. Now take a fork and a spoon. Press the tines of a fork onto the spoon. such that the toothpick will be balanced on the edges of the glass. Note, handles of forks should be placed towards the glass. Strike a matchstick and set fire to the end of the toothpick. Observe the changes. We have observed that the toothpick will burn down completely until it touches the wet rim of the glass and the remaining part of the toothpick will not burn, holds up the heavy fork and spoon. We have learned that the combination of fork, spoon and the tooth. We can say that the point where total weight appears to act is called center of gravity. In this activity, fork and spoon do not fall because the center of gravity is directly under the edge of the glass, where the point of support is. Toothpick weighs so little that it almost does not change their center of gravity. For example, if we try to get up from the chair, we cannot get up from chair without bending our body or legs due to center of gravity.